Also, I gotta know, I'm finally gonna get this stuff wrapped up. Get this stuff the dry cleaners to get the quo and be done with the complete waste of time. That has been the infraction from the last place that we're all sick of hearing about. We're all sick of hearing about the abuse. We wanna start hearing about victory for some of us. Anyways, I just wanna note that in the last since, you know, I went and got that stuff, which has been three weeks or something that I've been dealing with this. I've uh, lost three weeks worth of work. I've got my jewelry supplies. I've got my art supplies. I've got, you know, a whole bunch of old jeans that I've got to test my sewing machines out, see see what the moment of truth is. I'm pretty certain that leaving a sewing machine out exposed to the elements for a month is going to indeed, you know, um, affect the performance of my machine, which, by the way, this was a limited edition one that cannot be replaced. $1,000 sewing machine that was brand new. I had barely ever used, ever. So we're gonna see if it works, but yeah, no doubt the uh, function of it for the entirety of its life, it will be compromised. You know, it's metal parts. Metal plus water makes rust, right, freaks? And then lastly, I also had a bag of my macrame stuff. As you know, <laughs> this is yet another design of mine that blew up and went crazy everywhere. The mini macrame hangers, but guess who was the first one to do them? Yeah, I guess who was? Me. <laughs> guess who gets fucked? Me. Guess who has everything stolen from him? Me. <laughs> like the tea thing's about to happen. Me. I'm sick and tired of it. I'm not a freaking slave. I wasn't put on earth to people's people's slaves and for other people to benefit off of my ideas. Okay, this shit's unfair. It needs to change now.